a number x is increased by a small amount a, and we see that here, this is x, you increase it by a small amount a, and a number y is decreased by the same small amount a. So y is decreased by the same small amount a to get new numbers x prime and y prime, as shown on the number line below, fair enough. Which statement accurately describes, ac which statements ac accurately describe the distance between x and y prime? So let's read this first statement. The distance between x and y prime, so that distance, let me, let me do this in a, the distance between x and y prime, so that's this distance. Distance between x and y prime, so that's that right over there, is greater than the absolute value of x minus y. So what is the absolute value of x minus y? You're taking x, and from that you're subtracting y. y is a larger number, so that's going to be a negative value. But then you're taking the absolute value of it. So you're really just finding the absolute difference between those two numbers. So the absolute value of x minus y is just the distance between x and y. It's just this distance, this distance right, right over here. That's the absolute value of x minus y. So is this true, that this red distance, the distance between x and y prime is greater than this distance? No, clearly not. So this one is not correct. The distance, the distance between the x and y prime, that's the red distance right over there. Let me underline it again in red. The distance between the x and y prime is less than the absolute value of x minus y. Well, that's pretty, that's pretty clear. y prime is closer to x than y is. So this distance is less than that distance. That distance. So we can check the box right over there. That one is absolutely true. Now let's think of this next statement. The distance between x and y prime is equal to the absolute value of x minus y, which is this distance. This distance. I have trouble saying this distance. Which is this distance. This distance minus a. Well, that looks right. You take absolute value of x minus y. And from that, you subtract a. From that, you subtract a. What are you left with? Well, you're going to be left with the distance between x and y prime. So this looks correct. That looks correct right over there. So, so far, we're going with these middle two statements. Now, let's, go, let's look at this last one. It's so late in the day. I think I need to have, to get, have dinner or something. My brain is not working properly. But let's, let's power through. The distance, <laughs> I can't say this. The distance between x and y prime is equal to x prime minus y. So let's think about this a little bit. The distance between x and y prime. Well, one way we could write that is that is the absolute value of x minus the absolute value of x minus y prime. And they want us to compare that. We, they want us to compare x minus y prime. They want us to compare that to, I'll do this in magenta, to the absolute value of x prime minus y. x prime minus y. So one way I could think of approaching it, let's write, let's rewrite y prime and x prime in terms of x's, y's, and a's. So for example, y prime, y prime, and I'm overusing these colors too much. So y prime is equal to y minus a. So where we see y prime, let's substitute a y minus a there. So this right over here, this expression could be rewritten as the absolute value of x minus y minus a, y minus a, which is going to be equal to the absolute value of x minus y, minus y, let me write it this way, minus y, do the y in that same green color, minus y plus, plus a, plus a. So now I've rewritten this first statement, this first expression in terms of x's, y's, and a's. Now let's look at the second one. What is x prime? x prime is equal to x plus a, is equal to x plus a. So this can be rewritten as, if we substitute this with this, we get the absolute value of x plus a minus y. Well, if we switch this a and this negative y right over here, we would get the absolute value of x minus y plus a. So both of these expressions are equivalent, and this last statement is also true.